Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and so for today's video I'm going to be doing a chit chat get ready with me and I did this look right here and I absolutely love the way that it turned out. So I hope you guys like it as well. So if you guys want to hear about everything that I talked about and then also how I achieved this makeup look, then just go ahead and keep on watching. So for eyeshadow today, I'm going to be picking up my Anastasia Beverly Hills Soul Tree Palette. Since this is like a chatty get ready with me, I don't really feel like doing some really crazy makeup look because it is just more about like what I'm talking about and just kind of talking with you guys versus like the actual makeup that I'm using so I'm gonna go pretty natural on the eyes I know I go natural on the eyes all the time but yeah so let's just go ahead and get started so to start off I already went ahead and primed my eyelids and set them and everything like that and I'm going to pick up a combination of twig and then also birch just the two light brown matte shades and I'm actually just going to take the brush that comes with the palette and I'm going to go ahead and just apply that in my crease um, and kind of like all over the place. So that is literally all that we're doing as far as like matte eyeshadows. I just want this look to be super, super simple. So and now I'm going to go ahead and pick up the ColourPop Glitterly Obsessed and this is in the shade wish me luck. So I'm going to go ahead and apply this all over the lid. Oh wow, that is so beautiful. I don't know if you guys can really see the true like color, but that is so beautiful. As I'm looking at it, it has like a little bit of gold, green, and purple as I kind of like shift my eye. That is so beautiful. Now I'm going to go ahead and move on to mascara, and guys, this mascara is my holy grail, the best mascara I have ever tried in my entire life. It is so good. So this is the ColourPop BFF mascara, and I just get the shade black, and I recently just placed another order on ColourPop and purchased another mascara just because this mascara is just so, so good. Like, I don't know what it is, but ColourPop has just been killing the game, and this mascara is just amazing so I'm gonna go ahead and apply some of this okay so now we're gonna go ahead and move on to the face before we finish off the rest of the eyes so for primer today I'm gonna be picking up my Too Faced hangover primer I love this primer but yeah I really just wanted to film this chit chat get ready with me for you guys because I have been not on my normal uploading and filming schedule and it's driving me insane but normally I film on like Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, and then I'll have my videos for Monday, Wednesday, Friday of the following week, and last week was my spring break, and I wasn't going anywhere for spring break, I didn't really want to go anywhere, I just kind of wanted to stay here in Nashville, and I wanted to just work, and then also my sister was going to be visiting me like the last weekend of spring break, so I really just didn't want to go anywhere. Friday is like the start of my spring break, and I woke up on Friday feeling sick and then literally from Friday, Saturday and Sunday and then Monday I like every day I woke up with like another like sickness if that makes any sense. But first for foundation I'm going in with my Physicians Formula The Healthy Foundation. So I picked up the Morphe and Jeffree Star like sponge trio. I'm a little nervous because this is really hard. I went ahead and dampened it, but I like my beauty sponges to like be the softest thing ever and it's a little harder than what I'm used to, so I'm a little nervous, but we're going to go ahead and test it out today. But anyways, like I was saying, so like I felt like every day I just kept waking up to like something else that was wrong, whether I woke up with a sore throat, um, a runny nose, a cough, like all of this crazy annoying stuff and so it was just getting really frustrating so it's been two weeks now and yesterday when I woke up was the first day that like I felt a hundred percent because my sickness just kept getting worse and worse and it just wasn't good and I went on antibiotics and everything like that and it just like was not fun and so my spring break was not fun because I was literally just laying in bed but because of that I was not able to film just because obviously I was so sick 
and then when my sister came in town I didn't have time to film like an actual sit down video so I was just vlogging which is why like all my recent videos have been vlogs but yeah so it feels really good to finally just sit down and actually film a makeup video for you guys because that's what I love that's what I love doing so it just feels so good to kind of be back and be healthy again I love Jeffree Star, I love him so much, but this, uh, I just, I want to like it because I, I do really, really like Jeffree Star, but like, this sponge is just not, it's just not my thing, I'm not liking it. So for concealer today, I'm going to be picking up my Urban Decay All Nighter Waterproof Full Coverage Concealer. And I had a switch. I had a switch to my Sonia Kashuk Beauty Sponge just because that Morphe one was just like not doing it for me, which makes me so sad. Before we powder up the face, this is the e.l.f. Jelly Highlighter. And I picked this up at Ulta and I got the shade Bubbly. And it really intrigued me just because it's like straight up jelly. So I just dipped my finger in it and I'm just going to go ahead and apply that right there and then also on this side of my face and I'm just gonna blend this out using my fingers you can use like your beauty sponge or brush or something but I just feel like with textures like this I just feel like it's better to use your fingers that literally just looks like I don't know if you can see it on camera but like in person that looks terrible like it looks like just like a straight stripe like that does not look good I think I might have let it sit too long on my skin. Like this side, it looks fine, but this side is like a mess. <laughs> but I really need to set my under eyes because they are creasing so bad. So for powder, it is no surprise we're using the Maybelline Fit Me Powder. So and now we're going to go ahead and finish off the eyes before we finish off the rest of the face. So I'm going to pick back up my Sultry palette and the under eye is just going to be super, super simple. So I'm just going to take this brown matte shade called Twig and again, I'm just going to use the brush that comes with the palette and I'm just going to go ahead and apply this on my lower lash line. Alright, so now we're going to move on to the inner corner highlight and I'm going to take a combination of... Pearl, which is this shade right here. This shade is stunning. And then I'm also going to take a little bit of this shade. I have no idea how to pronounce this. This is C-Y-B-O-R-G, Cyborg? I have no idea. But I'm just going to take a combination of those two shades. They're really pretty. It's like a champagne shade and then also just like a silver. And I'm using my ColourPop E10 brush to apply this. Okay, and then for a lower lash mascara, I'm going to be picking up my Benefit Bad Gal Bang Mascara. So I just quickly filled in my brows and now we're going to move on to bronzer and so I'm going to be picking up my Benefit Hoola bronzer. So spring break is over and I'm really excited because the next like break that we have with school is Easter break and I'm going to New York and I am so excited. I'm going to be visiting my sister in the city for New York so I'm really excited about that. It's going to be a really fun time. I'm going to be getting a lot of good like vlog footage there so I'm really excited to go to New York and then I really don't have any plans for the summertime and I also don't know where I'm going to be because I've been applying to internships in New York and then also here in Nashville and also some in Chicago too which is like where I'm from so I don't know where I'm going to end up. Ideally I would like to end up either in New York because I want to potentially move to New York after I graduate so it would be great to kind of know what it's like to actually live in New York like for a full summer to see if like okay is this something I can do or am I gonna absolutely hate living here so ideally I would like to be in New York but I also would want to be here in Nashville because I do currently have a job here and so I don't want to have to leave my job for three months or I don't want to have to quit my job so I don't really know what is gonna end up happening but a lot of the internships that I've applied to have been to like really big companies that are like very competitive that's kind of like my summer plans because I don't really know where I'm going to end up for the summertime so we will 
we will see what happens I'll definitely update you guys on what ends up happening so for blush I'm gonna pick up my Tarte blush and this is in the shade unstoppable I'm just gonna go ahead and apply this just kind of right here you guys know the drill with blush with how I like it so now for highlight I am really excited so I have been really into loose highlights and so I picked this one up from Wet n Wild and this is in the shade I'm so lit so I'm just gonna go ahead and apply this on top of that elf highlight to kind of see if we can fix that I really love this highlight it definitely is very like sparkly like oh my god do you see that it is so blinding and it is just so so beautiful like wow I am glowing so I'm gonna go ahead and quickly set my face makeup before we apply the lip so I'm going to pick up my ColourPop all-star setting spray okay so my favorite part we are going to be going in with a red lip and I have been wanting to wear a red lip for so long I don't know why I just like just really have been in the mood to wear a red lip. So this is my current favorite red lip. So this is from the Twinkling Lights collection between Kathleen Lights and ColourPop. And this is in the shade Lucky Star. This is such a beautiful, beautiful shade. So I'm going to go ahead and apply this. Alright guys, so this is the finished makeup look. And I really love the way that this makeup look turned out. It's honestly so crazy because just putting this red lip on, I just feel like a million times better. I don't know what it is, but just red lips are just like such a confidence boost for me. I don't know. I just feel like when I put on a red lip, I can just like conquer the world. So I'm feeling so good. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel because I do post videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So there's always new content on my channel for you guys. And definitely make sure to follow me on all my social medias. I'll make sure to leave those in the description box down below so you guys can go ahead and check them out. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.